Hey, welcome back. So you have this friend who you either know for a long time or just met. You notice something odd about him, but like in a good way. He's really nice to you and you guys just click. Now you're wondering if he has feelings for you. Yeah, I know, you don't want to flat out ask him because that will kind of ruin the friendship you guys have going on or make things awkward if he says no. So to understand him a little bit more, I've compiled a list. A list of 15 signs he likes you more than a friend. Number one, he wants to know you better. When a guy likes you, he just wants to know everything about you. He wants to know how you got the scars on your arms, every tragedy you've ever been through, and the way you grew up. This doesn't mean that he just wants you to talk. He genuinely wants to know more about you. Later on, you'll see that the stories you share will help him create a stronger bond with you. When a guy is attracted to you, the way he approaches you and talks to you will be different. You will realize that he cannot easily forget your stories and since you are open to him about it, he will open up to you as well. Number two, he gets physical with you. He will want to be close to you as possible. He will find lame excuse to touch you, but of course in an appropriate way. If this is the case, just know that he wants to move the relationship to the next level. Just notice those excuses like brushing your shirt, touching your hand, giving you hugs, or giving you a high five just to come in contact with you. On the other hand, there are shy guys who do not do this and that's okay because he respects you and totally understands personal space. But being physical with you is a strong indicator that he likes you. Number three, he will remember the things you tell him. If you happen to share a story with him, especially regarding your personal life, he will remember the details of it. He will probably remember it way better than the exams he tried to study for last night. He will never forget your birthday, your dog's name, your hometown, your favorite food, and other minute details. In reality, a typical guy would not care about things like that if he didn't like you. However, since he does, then there must be some form of attraction. If he remembers everything you tell him, then it means he's trying to pursue you or that he has a photographic memory, which is unlikely true. Number four, watch out for those long gazes. When a guy has a crush on you, he can't just sit there and daydream about you or keep staring at you because he can't get enough of you. Sounds creepy, right? But wait, it's true. When you like something and you don't know if you can get it, you'll just stare at it like a kid staring at a toy. But in this case, he's staring at you because he wants a relationship with you. If you catch him looking at you frequently, there's a great chance that he's falling for you already. Number five, he takes initiative. Whatever he wants to do, he'll be the first to do it and ask you, whether it's going out together, messaging you, or doing other things to get your attention. At this point, he already has it in his mind that he is set on pursuing you. You will know that he'll finally gather up the confidence and courage to do such a thing. And that's probably hard for some guy to do. So be prepared for that. If there's an opportunity or he knows that you are interested in him as well, he'll be the first to ask you out. Number six, he calls or messages you a lot, or he does both. He will find excuses to call or text you if he likes you. Friends normally text each other, but if he calls you, then there could be something more to it. If the call lasts more than an hour, you can tell that he is interested in you. If you want to hold a conversation with him, you can check out my other video on how to keep a conversation going with a guy. Link is in the description if you want to check it out. But at the end of the day, it's up to you to determine whether the calls are normal or if there's something going on. As for texting, you know that those good morning texts and those good night texts will be the norm. And you bet you'll get at least one text a day from him if he is interested in you. Number seven, he gives you lots of compliments. Look at how many times he tells you that you are smart or dress beautifully. If he is the kind of person that doesn't like complimenting people but takes every opportunity to compliment you, then you can be sure that he has some feelings for you. I mean, who doesn't want to be showered with compliments inside and out? Number eight, watch out for jealousy. This is super obvious. If he gets jealous when you talk to other guys, then it's a strong indicator that he likes you. If you share your love life that's opposite from his thoughts and he responds in a jealous way, then that's a strong sign that he likes you more than a friend. This is the hardest to fake or even conceal. The stronger his feelings for you, the more jealous he will get when he sees you with another guy. 
Number nine, he makes you laugh. Sometimes a tease or two won't hurt you, but will make you laugh. He won't cross the line and go overboard and be mean to you. He'll crack some corny jokes with you just to make you laugh. If he can make you smile and laugh every time, then he can be a potential keeper. Sometimes a funny guy is just what you want to have a happy relationship. Number ten, he talks to you differently. Maybe he is not the kind of person that is open to share everything with his friends, but he opens up to you. Observe the detail he share with you. If he shares some of his most sensitive information with you, then it is a sure indicator that he likes you enough to do it. Men are open to share sensitive information with those people that they trust and like. Watch and compare the way he talks to you and his friends. Is it something special and different? How is his tone of voice? A man who wants to move his friendship with a woman to the next level will not just talk to her like one of his guy friends or an acquaintance. Number eleven. He respects you. If a man doesn't respect you, then he is not worthy of you. He will respect your values, opinions, your time, and overall you as a person. He won't be forceful and try to change you because you are you and you are unique, and that's what he likes about you. If he is not respectful, then I believe you shouldn't be with him to begin with. Because imagine the relationship down the road. You will have many differences and break up. Now, do you want that? Number twelve. Listen to his comments concerning other women. If you pay close attention on how he comments about other women, then you can be sure whether he wants your relationship advice or if he wants you to realize that you are the woman he wants. He might ask you what kind of guy you want in your life. This will help him understand you more and plan his next move to try to get with you. If he shares some information about his past relationship, then he may already trust you and want you to know where he is coming from, and he has nothing to hide. But that's if you ask him, and he's willing to share the information with you. This leads to number thirteen, that he doesn't mention other girls with you. I believe this is common sense, but just in case, if the guy really likes you, he probably won't bring up other girls or vent about them. That's if you decide to ask him. He will never want to jeopardize a chance with you by bringing up the past. Doing so will just make him seem like a player if he has a long history. And girls typically don't want to date a player, unless you're really into that. Then this doesn't matter, I guess. Number fourteen. He likes being around you. He is always happy to see you. His face will light up with a genuine smile all the time. When he is with you, he likes listening to your problems or simply listen to you talk because he wants to be there for you. Also, he does it because he cares about you. He wants to spend more time with you because he likes you. If he flirts with you, that's a strong sign that he's into you. But at the same time. He wants to test the water to see if you're interested in him or not. If you like it, then just let him continue being him. Number fifteen. Pay attention to his body language. A guy's body language can tell you a lot about his interest in you. I've created a video talking about how a guy secretly likes you with body language. You can check it out if you want. Link is in the description. To briefly go over this, you can check and see if his body is engaged with you when you are talking to him. If his front body is facing towards you, then he is engaging with you and paying close attention. He may also lean close to you when you are talking. Also, watch if he locks eye contact with you. Again, physical contact is a huge giveaway that he's into you. You know those accidental bumps and hand brushes he does to touch you? Yeah, those. They aren't so accidental now that you know. Overall, if a guy really likes you, then he will eventually ask you out. But that is if he genuinely feels that you are interested in him as well. Some guys can be direct, and some guys can be shy at times. For those shy guys, you should give him a little push or reciprocate your feelings back to him, so he knows your sign. Once he feels comfortable and know you are more likely to say yes, he will ask you and want to move the relationship to the next level. I hope these signs will help you. And if you like this video, please like, subscribe, and comment down below to share some of your stories with the community. And as always, thanks for watching.